My people shelter beneath the great machine. This is beyond simple generosity. I must thank Ikora for her gift. This sanctuary is not granted by Ikora alone, but by all who live in the last city. Yes, and on their behalf, let me extend a welcome. I am Osiris, and this is Lakshmi too. Future War Court leader and city representative. My greatest appreciations to you both. The House of Light thanks you. Your house can best show gratitude by keeping to itself. I know your assistance with the Vex will benefit us all, but not everyone in the city is so open-minded. You appear to be settling in. I will leave you to it. If you require further help from us, you must only ask. Uh, I shall. Uh, there are several modifications we will need for stable ether production. Submit a proposal to Ikora. She seems willing to get you anything you need. I must return to the people in the city. Future War Court has foreseen great misery for them in the days ahead. And they will need an advocate. I often forget how highly those in the tower have placed themselves. The air is thin there. Best not to breathe too much of it. You must understand this situation is tense for us all. This encampment perches on the edge of decree and democracy. I hope your stay with us will be uneventful. As do I. Think of ether as food for Elixni, a form of sustenance. That's only partially true. Ether also catalyzes physical maturation and promotes molting. In that sense, it's like hormones in human adolescence. In a world of unlimited ether, like Rees before the whirlwind, all Elixni look like captains. That's our final form. Most elixir you see now are underdeveloped. They're forever stunted by ether rationing, which began as a necessity and gradually evolved into a mechanism of social control. Now, ruthless leaders like Spider use the distribution of ether to keep their followers dependent. If elixir are ever to live in peace, we must make ether available to all. Regardless of rank.
witch bitch was added by a different house. It's a tradition that lasted generations. Most of those houses are now extinct, and their members are scattered. It's funny. I revered the great machine all my life, without ever having seen it. And now that it's right overhead, I still look to this shrine for comfort. Thank <laughs> you. 